Welcome back, racers, to another round nine of the BTCC right, anyway. Championship, guys. And is the final round at the Red Bull Ring Short Track round Circuit. Um, now, it's a reverse grid from round eight, guys. If you haven't checked out race eight and seven, go and check them out. Uh, but here we go. We are going to be starting down in... I can't see. I think that's about 11th position, as we'll see on the grid in a second. Uh, with our championship rivals behind us. So, here we go. Yeah, 11th out of 12. Can we get a good launch? Off the line. Right about now. Let's go. Let's see how we do. We know Lee whips quick as well as we get Brody on the start there. Now Too Fast is starting to pick up that pace there. He's on the inside here. So, I think we're going to follow Too Fast through the pack here as Lee Whip makes a weird turn in there. Uh, we actually shove him up about four places. He's lucky he didn't go to the moon on that shove. So here we go then. We're going to go into turn two as we get uh, pots on the inside there. Tucked up behind too fast. Now, everyone's through. There's a penalty there picked up by, uh, is that Bailey? Brody's probably going to follow us through. So he's going he's gonna to duck out to the right here, take his penalty as he does. So we're coming into turn five. Still behind too fast. Now, obviously, too fast is where we need to be. Uh, up with, okay, as we can see. If he's going to make a move, we're probably going to go with him as we get a good run out there. Uh, now there's cars everywhere. We do get blocked by too fast. We send him up a little bit into them as we're going to look at trying to get the outside, inside, back to the outside. And we're going to try and get the cut back on, uh, on our boy Lee Whip here. So, too fast runs wide. Angry man runs wide. Sixth, seventh, and eighth. All in a group here now as we've got the inside. Now we see Lee Whips on the outside here. Or the inside, sorry. He just absolutely recklessly chucks it up the inside. Bashing everyone as you can see here. Now I actually go up the inside. But too fast gets bashed as well. So I get forced out into the grass. As you can see, okay, Lee Whip has literally just manhandled everyone. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull in behind. Let too fast have his spot back. And then we're going to go in to continue racing. Because I feel like it was a little bit unfair for too fast. Isn't no win the championship race. We've got to give respect, guys. Okay. So uh, I don't feel like that's my fault. I feel like that's definitely Lee Whip's fault. And there's the first penalty for this race. Um, now, actually going back uh, to last to position uh, I, I felt like we did with the penalty, there. guys. Now, is this whip. how this race is going to um, turn out for us? It's super unlucky that we just picked up that pen there, though. Definitely a uh, dodgy lap that was. A lot of that could have been uh, been avoided. Lee, I'm sorry if you're watching, dude. That was definitely uh, definitely not the right move to be making there. But uh, not this early on in the race anyway. But we're going to move past that. Let's see if we can catch back up to the pack now. Uh, we can't see too fast being in that group. So he's somewhere between 4th and 7th. Which is not, not bad. But at least he's not up in the first for us. Him getting first place now would be uh, absolutely devastating to the championship race. As we come around Ben 6 there. Onto the back straight to complete lap 3. Onto lap 4 now. We are behind Pots. Now we should be able to stick a move on Pots down here. Um, as we do get the inside. Now we're going to come out side by side by the look of it as he runs a little bit wide there. Uh, now, into turn two, we do have the inside, so we should get the job done here, which we do. Pots, yep, comes in behind us. That's a good overtake there, to be fair. Right, now we've got our eyes set on Bailey. Can we catch Bailey up as well? around the final bend there that's a very very good exit out so are we in the slip of the uh of bailey it doesn't look like we are nope nowhere near so we should be coming out of this bend here turn one we should be up the back end of them as you can see angry man actually gets an awful run out there to be fair and we give him an absolute shove again uh, there's nowhere we could go, so we have to we have to hit him and hope that he can hold it, right? He's got an awful exit out of there. So he actually gets over... He overtakes Bailey again just from that move, which is a bit strange. 
but it happens. So, we're on the back end of these boys now. Let's see how we can develop an overtake as we look for our right line through. As you can see, these two go in pretty uh, defensive. And defending again, battling side by side. This is good racing from these boys here. Now, unfortunately, uh, Angry Man, I don't know, somehow gets in front of me there. I, I'm not sure what happened. I'm definitely nudged him, but um, I didn't feel like we nudged him hard. I don't know why he went like that. But uh, I guess that would be our mistake. As we get another little nudge back from him. <laughs> uh, so, this is good racing from the boys, to be fair. Um, so, as we come in to turn... Two. So much Bailey's got a good line through there. Uh, now, what are we? Half a second behind him. Not close enough to make any sort of move well, here. Right now. Can we uh, bring down a bit of the gap here on a good run out? Now, as you can see, we get a good run. Now, we should be able to get some clean air here as someone's taken a penalty to the right here. So, we've got to be fully aware when they finish their penalty, they're going to be coming back to the left, which they have. So, we can't really go diving up the inside. Now, as you see, drum max there as well. Um, we still keep it on the track, though. We didn't get any uh, avoiding of the track there. So, that's great racing as we slip into ninth position. Now, Bailey goes a little bit sharp there. Now, I'm surprised he... Oh, okay, he did get a penalty. I was going to say, I'm surprised he didn't get a penalty there. I can't remember this part of the race. So that's going to be someone else taking another penalty as he goes out to the right here. Now, this is what I was on about earlier, guys. Penalties on this track are absolutely insane. I mean, there is so many runoff bits that can catch you. And you will see that a lot of people get these penalties, guys. Okay, as we're up in eighth now. So we are behind Pablo and Lee Whip. Uh, now we can see Too Fast is third. He is actually getting through the pack, guys. Um, so this is something we don't want to see. As we see, Pablo is trying to stick a move on Lee Whip there. Pulls out. We actually all run wide there, apart from Lee Whip. So Pablo and myself are probably going to pick up penalties here. Uh, yep, there's a half a second penalty for me as we get on the back end of Lee Whip, which is really annoying because we're just shutting that gap now into halfway through the field. It's a penalty I could definitely do without having. And as you can see, uh, Pablo had one as well. So we're going to take it in between the straights of Ben 5 and 6, I think. I know a lot of people were taking it before Ben 5 there. But in my eyes, that's just uh, that's a silly place to take it. And I kind of feel that was a bad spot by me. I did it a little bit late. Um, which is super annoying because I, I don't normally think like that. Um... So, we do force our boy Pablo. As you see, he uh, scrapes the inside of us. But no casualties from that silly mistake by myself there. So, as you see, we turn turn one. And we're battling in 7th, 8th oh, and ninth now. As we cut the corner again for another penalty. Another penalty on that corner. Just silly penalties we're giving away now. Um, so, we're going to be having to pull over again. For the second lap in a row to shade off this penalty. Um, so we're probably going to drop back to ninth or 10th with this one. Now we decide not to do it there. Uh, we actually decide doing it on the out of that corner. Um, now we're out of the racing line, not affecting anyone. As you can see, Angry Man is all the way back there in 12. So we're going to sit back in 11th oh, um, after that penalty again. So lap 10, six and a half minutes left. Can we kind of get some laps going now without the penalties? As uh, Who was that? Was that Potts? Potts got a little bit sideways there and we, uh, we actually get him on the outside. Uh, as you can see, he goes flying off the background and misses his braking zone. As you can see, we're tucking up now behind Drum Mac. Penalty after penalty after penalty. You can just see by my face, I'm not very happy at this point in the race. We know too fast is second. We are giving away penalties that we really just shouldn't be uh, shouldn't be giving away, to be fair. Poor, poor race for me so far. So, Drum Mac runs wide there. Does he pick up a penalty for that one? He does. He picks up a second. That's a huge penalty given there That's for him. Uh, so, we get ourselves ninth place. 
I took a penalty. Back into turn one. Now, good run through. Fantastic run through. Can we get close enough to Pablo for turn five and six, guys? That is the question from here. As we take a slightly deeper run, so it gives us a slower out. But we get a good run through turn three into turn four. And we should be... Or we are. We are in the clean air now. Now, can we get a good run out of turn five and do him between turn five and six? There's not much of a cutback option there, but you do get a cutback option on this one here. If you can get a good run out. And as you see, we go a little bit slower through. Again, someone ahead of him picks up another penalty. That's going to be Bailey. Uh, now, are we going to be able to take full advantage of his penalty there? We should be able to. We should get the job done before the bend. As you can see, he tucks in behind us. So, we're up into eighth behind Pablo. Following Pablo through the pack now. Now, we can see Brody's up ahead of us. He's, uh, you know, must be about three or four seconds ahead of this little pack that we're racing in right now. As we get a good line through there. Pablo's slow. Now, as you can see, he's held it. We're not close enough now to make any sort of impact. I did think we were going to be alongside him coming out by the uh, the mare that he had in that bend. So, bend five. What can we do? Right up his back end. We take it super wide. Uh, this is going to be another penalty again for sure. Um, are we going to pick that penalty up? Yes. Second as well. That's huge. That's a huge penalty. Uh, again, as we drop back. <laughs> to 10th position after another penalty guys 17 seconds behind the leader now if we look up in the top left in the actual uh, position section we've got sleep and thomas first and second which means thomas has put a move on too fast bringing too fast back into third so that's what i want to see at this point definitely when i'm back in 10th this is what i want to see winning the championship we're down in 10th So here we go, over the line to complete lap 13, to start lap 14. Someone else has picked up a penalty there, that would be Pablo. So as we come down into turn 1, we get a good exit out. Now, we are in the slip, or no, we're not quite in the slip actually, we're just out of the slip. About 600 temps, 650 temps of a second is about the very edge of the slipstream guys, the clean air that the car ahead is punching. Uh, so we're just out of that right now. So we're not catching up uh, through anything of just pure power right now. Just the, the, the track through. So as you can see now, we are definitely in that slip. Within 400 tenths of a second, we are there. So we should get some free time down this back straight. As Pablo gets a really bad run out of there. And we are right up his back end. Unfortunately, we do lose a little bit of that momentum uh, from pushing him. And it is a drag race. Down in two, bend one. We are getting the better end of this with the inside. We break a little bit earlier. Uh, now, I think we let him have that a little bit there. Yeah, we're going to let him have that a bit. We're going to tuck out to the right, but we're going to let him know we're still here. We're still going to overtake on this inside. So don't go diving over as he gives us the good room. That's good racing by Pablo. Uh, now, we shut the door for the inside for him. And that is uh, the move complete, guys. So we actually done half a lap side by side racing. So we got one and a half minutes left of the race as Drum Matt gets a penalty as well. Doesn't serve the complete penalty there. So he's going to have to dive in here oh, and take again. his penalty as we run wide again. Now, what penalty do we get? We pick up another oh. second. Ah, screw this. As you can see, we're not happy with that. And Pablo picked up a penalty there. So all three picked up, a, picked up the penalty. How do I sometimes get half a second and then I get a second? I mean, I don't understand that at all. So, back into 10th. Well, Angry like Man in 11th. Instant. Potts back in 12th. What can we do here? There's no back markers for the first lot of people to catch up. Um, so, you know, it's not too bad for them. 
awful race for us though. Right, so here we go. We're going to be going over for the final lap now, guys. Sitting in 10th with Pablo and Drum Mac just ahead of us. Can we secure ninth place? Now, we give Pablo a huge I'm there. I'm hit there. An shock up on this one. Um, so we wheezed off. I'm not sure Can what Pablo was doing that slow into the bend, but it's all good. Uh, he hasn't lost anything due to that. As he takes a. Uh, Difficult approaching, I would say, to turn three there. Uh, but he gets through turn three and four quite nicely. Uh, so at this point, we are not looking like we're going to get this ninth position unless he makes a mistake here, or we get a fantastic run through five and six. And as you can see, we definitely don't get that fantastic run. So to polish off round nine, guys, it looks like we're going to get another penalty. And uh, that secures... Round nine, guys, in 10th position. And as you can see, my face is not happy. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this weekend of racing. I have split it into three videos. Please go and check out the rest of the championship. We are only halfway through the season. Uh, and we also got the Porsche 911 championship live on Twitch tonight, guys. But you can catch up with the videos during YouTube. Take care, and I'll see you in the next one.